Hello and welcome to the video download and install OpenJDK 22 on macOS. I am Nam Haming at Code Java.net. In this video, I'd love to share with you the steps to set up Java Development Kit version 22 on Mac computer so you can get started to develop or run Java applications on Mac OS. So, what is OpenJDK? You know. OpenJDK is a production ready and open source and distribution of Java development kit and JDK version 22 is a regular update of Java SE platform it is a non-long-term support release of Java SE non-LTS and OpenJDK open 22 was released on March uh, the 19th, 2024 and OpenJDK is distributed as archive file such as child.gg and zip, uh, no installer for OpenJDK. And to set up OpenJDK 22 on macOS, you should download uh, the binary distribution of OpenJDK 22 from its uh, official download page at this URL. And verify SHA256 checksum after download. And uh, to set up uh, you need to extract the archive file and then update the java underscore home and path environment variables. Now let's download the binary distribution of OpenJDK22 for Mac OS. So head over to the official download page of uh, OpenJDK22 at this URL jdk.java.net slash 22. You see, this is the official OpenJDK 22 download page, and for Mac OS, uh, for Mac computers, there are two different builds. The first one is Mac OS uh, Arch 64. Uh, this uh, build is for Mac computer running uh, with Apple chip or Apple Silicon, and the second build is uh, Mac OS X 64. Uh, this build is for Mac computers uh, running uh, on Intel chip. So uh, I'm using Mac computer that uh, is running on Apple M1 chip. As you can see here, that means I need to download the archive file uh, for Mac OS Arch 64 here. So click the download link, child.gg uh, here, to download the binary distribution of OpenZDK22. For Mac OS, I save uh, the file into a downloads uh, directory in my user home. Okay, just a moment for the download uh, complete, as you can see here. It is about 187 megabytes. Okay, you see, this is a child.gg archive file, the binary distribution of OpenJDK22. And next, it's strongly recommended to verify the integrity of the downloaded archive file by checking its SHA-256 checksum value uh, on the official download page here. You can see there's a link SHA-256 next to the download link here. Click and you can see the uh, uh, SHA-256 checksum of the uh, file. Okay, and to verify the integrity of the downloaded file open terminal window and change the current directory to the directories to the directory where the archive file is stored as you can see here open the dk22 and use this command to get the sha256 checksum value sha sha dash a256 and then the file name then you see it prints the SHA-256 checksum value of the downloaded file and we need to compare this value against the one published on the official download page. You see both are identical, that means we are safe to use this uh, binary uh, distribution of OpenZDK22. And then uh, we need to extract the uh, downloaded archive file to a specific uh, folder. Uh, okay, so um, 
and let me uh, go to my user home directory here and I create a new folder here open JDK you see open JDK here and now I extract the uh, downloaded archive file into this directory using this command da dash xf and then file name open jdk dot dot gg and dash c and specify the destination directory is in my user home directory and uh, open jdk okay done and uh, let me change the current directory to uh, open jdk and you can see it is extracted into this directory jdk dash 22 dot jdk uh, and let me uh, go to that directory jdk and you can see the content directory contents you see home and this is the installation directory of open jdk 22 and inside the bin directory uh, you can see the, some binary programs such as java java c uh, that can be used to compile and run uh, java programs okay so if i type java java command now you see i got the error unable to locate the java runtime and that means I need to uh, configure system environment variables. And the next step is uh, configuring the system environment variables Java Home. So you can use the Java command uh, anywhere in the terminal. Okay, so in, uh, let me try this command to see the full directory of uh, OpenJDK installation directory and uh, let me uh, change the current directory to my user home and then uh, we need to update the cell resource file uh, using this command cat and greater than sign and the file name is dot g s s r c and then the content of the file is uh, export java home equal user home directory and then open jdk uh, and jdk task 22 dot jdk contents home and the next line is export path the path uh, system environment variable equal java underscore home and then uh, slash and then bin and uh, colon and the path uh, directory itself the path environment variable itself and rest control D to uh, save the content of the file and type cat.gssrc command again to verify the export commands here okay and then uh, we need to uh, quit the terminal and open a new one okay quit terminal open a new one here and then type java command Okay, you see it works now. Let me uh, clear and type again Java uh, dash version, and you can see it prints Open JDK version 22, released on 2024 March uh, the 19th, and type Java C dash version to see the version of Java compiler. You see Java C 22. That means I have successfully. Uh, installed uh, open jdk 22 on mac os so from now on i can get started to uh, develop java applications with the latest version of java or uh, run java applications on mac os all right so far you have seen how to set up open jdk 22 on mac os let me sum up the key the key steps you need to follow firstly you need to download the uh, binary distribution of OpenJDK from its official download page at this URL and then verify the checksum 
uh, of the uh, downloaded file using this command shasham and then extract the archive file using this command and then update uh, environment variables by uh, creating the shell resource file.gssrc and put to uh, export entries in the file like this and verify the installation of OpenJDK by using the command java dash version and java c dash version. I hope you found this video helpful. Please subscribe to my channel, like, comment, and share this video. Thanks for watching.